I spent 400 days in a Rim world of magic. Can we survive a demon attack and continue defending the base with endless explosions and magical golems? I'm playing on the hardest difficulty. Welcome back to 300 days here in Rim world. So where we last left off, well, we got a bunch more magical powers here. We've got so many new mages here and one of the best weapons, Winter's Rain. So yeah, we will continue right off and try to start working on completely completing the game. Yes, yeah, so we will just continue right off, research some more, and see what happens. I would like to get a hospital down, so hospital beds up to vitals monitor, and I would also like to replace everybody's assault rifles with these charged miniguns. Uh-oh, a breakup on Ava and Raiden. Whatever. Well then, the hospital will be right here. Now, another charged minigun. I love these weapons. And a siege from the cancer crew. I think it's time for the explosion. Might need a double explosion for this. This will be the greatest explosion in all of Rimworld. Right there. And then poor old dude right about, yeah, I don't know, somewhere. Oh, <laughs> Oh my goodness, that was the best thing that I've seen in RimWorld. That was the best thing that I've ever seen in this game. Yeah, so that is an easy way of taking care of literally any threat in the game. Oh, that is the best thing. I just keep on repeating myself the best thing that I've seen. Yeah, Flamadin, are you the only survivor? He must have been so panicked. He only has a left arm. His right arm was torn off. Malarkey's detonation painfully annihilated Flamedin's right arm. He must be so confused. Now then, hospital coming in nicely. Ah, the King Claw is up. No more psychite addiction, although he still has chemical damage in his brain. Now then, we got some hops coming in, so time for beer. We got some fermenting barrels here in the brewery. And vital spawner, so we can finish off the hospital. And even get our vital center. Increases medical tank quality, surgery success chance, and immunity gain speed. I also need medicine production, need to create that. We also have a bulk goods trader, so this is what we're trading. And I mean, we have two resurrector mech serums, so do we resurrect Sydney? Yeah, I'm not sure actually, she cannot do any work, which is the problem. I'll have to think about it, but I do not think we need her. More and more charged miniguns coming in. Uh, we need to scan for more plasteel once more. Why does this always happen? So after medicine production, you scan at the ground penetrating scanner. We also have rare thrombos. How many? Four of them. And I also have an idea that might be bad, but I think it will be worth it. So the King Claw here has, of course, chemical damage in his brain. So what if we kill him and have someone eat up his head so this disappears? Because if we kill him and resurrect him, then this will still be in there, the chemical damage. So we need to remove the head. And then once we use the Resurrector Mixer with his head off, it will regenerate the head without it. So yeah, let's just simply simply do this. Goodbye to King Claw for like a moment. Now then, someone has to eat him. Who wants to eat the guy? Why do we not have any cannibals in the colony? That is so bad. Well then, the green swarm, you seem very happy, so you shouldn't feel this that much. Yes, just eat the human on the table. I need you to keep on consuming him, the green swarm, until, okay, you ate the eye, that is quite yummy, but the whole head, even more, even more, oh no, he must be filled up now, no? Can somebody else eat it? Yeah, 24 hours, that's not too bad. Yeah, if I ate human meat, then I would forget it in 24 hours, that's for sure. Who wants a taste of human meat? I wish I had some. In game, of course, in game, not in real life. Sacred, you have a taste, you have a taste. There we go so the head is off so now it should work sacred use resurrector mech serum and there we go the king claw without the brain damage so it works if they have anything in their brain make sure to eat their head before resurrecting them i mean we had to use the resurrector mech serum somehow but i've also used the heater mech serum but don't think we'll get one anyways the king claw i need you to do planting well done four charged minigun should be able to take care of this Ah, they live. Somehow they live. Interesting. 
Those are a few dead thrombos. Now then, the King Claw is up and healthy. Oh no, forgot about Go Juice for Kami. Might need to research Go Juice production. Yeah, we need more Plasteel. So just get this at the edge of the map. What in the world is this? Demon attack. The end is nigh. Rampaging demons are attacking your colony. Like a herald to impending doom, fire and ash have begun falling from the skies. These infernal beings have an assortment of attacks and challenging tactics. However, demons are unable to remain in this realm for extended periods and will be forced to return to their hellish plane in about three hours. Defeat or outlast this nightmare. There is very little time to prepare. Good luck. Uh, let's see here. Can't be that bad, right? Ah, uh, what in the world is going on? Uh-oh, Empire people, help us. What in the world is this? Okay. What in... Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, this is absolutely horrible. Sacred. I need you to shield us. What in the... Kagaruf? Oh my goodness. Um, what just happened? What just happened? Please kill these things. Somebody kill these damn things. Oh my... Are we dead? What is this? What? Everybody is down, Che. Man in black... How in the world are we supposed to kill these things? Uh, yeah, I think they're going away, but we have lost so much. Silver, everybody is just dead. I know Jay now. Yeah, rip Jay, rip the colony. Uh, yeah, they have fled, but the colony is absolutely destroyed. If only someone can get up, but I don't think that will happen. Everybody's dying. Silver, everything is just... Dead. Come on, someone, please get up. Ruby might get up. Yeah, she isn't too hurt. So, how many people died? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. More to die. Ava is death resting. I mean, she might be fine. Nobody else really has a medical emergency, but yeah. This has been hell. The whole colony has been ravaged by some demons. What will happen to this colony? Anybody, please get up. I beg you. Yeah, we had a royal tribute collector and even they got demolished by the demons. Rip Silver. Rip the Green Swarm. Raiden. Who else? Tsar Lugo. Sacred. And now poor old dude died from blood loss. The King Claw, please get healed. Soul I light. Uh, this is horrible. Oh, cargo pods with weapons from Randy. What's the plan? Lord Chimpus has died. I mean, our only option now is, I don't know, we still have all this wealth, no more defenses. Do we have to settle on a new tile? I think so. We have lost everything. Oh, Ava, Ava, she's up. After death resting for a while, but her left leg was destroyed. We need Hemogen, we need Hemogen, we need to tend to um, Ruby, we need to tend to to Akami uh, Starvation. So who is up? Melarki, the King Claw, and Ruby, Neva. Well then, Neva will consume a Hemogen pack. Now then, tend to Ruby, coagulate her wounds, and then just rescue her. We need to feed Melarki and everyone before they starve to death. Ava is so sad. She's about to have a mental break. Yeah, I mean, everybody died. I mean, sometimes things are not meant to go our way. That's just how it is here in the Rim world. But I actually have no idea how to deal with those demon attacks. That was something else. You can't even run because they will fly straight to you. Well, we have one Resurrector Mech Serum, so who should we use it up on? Silver, the Fire Mage, I suppose. But is she worth it? I think so. Please coagulate everyone, Melarki. Or I mean, Ava. We need to keep on feeding everyone before we have a mental break. Dead bodies lie everywhere. 
the colony is now just completely silent. Oh well, the people that we have remaining are now fine. They should all be fine, but I mean, this is not a fine situation at all. I have no idea how I could let this happen. Ambrosia, whatever. The Hemogen farm also remains. He is, uh, he's very cool. Do we have any medics? Okay, Ruby is a medic, so that's good. She remains. But yeah, Silver, we need to use a Resurrector Mix Serum on her. Welcome back to life, Silver. Blindness? Are you kidding me? Yeah, that is just great, I suppose. Ah, the King Claw is up. Welcome, welcome to hell. The demons made this place a hell by killing off everyone. Yeah, I have no idea how we're supposed to deal with raids now. Not a lot of people to shoot at targets, which means, yeah, no defensive measures. We'll have to see what happens, I suppose. We need to keep on feeding people before they starve. Well, a lot of people are up now, so that's good. So, what did we lose? We do not have a crafter. Nobody can cook. Yeah, I'm not sure what the plan for the colony is now. Do we just flee away and settle on a new tile or continue here? Yeah, this is the great slaughter of the colony. We have to make sarcophaguses. Well, Malarkey is a pretty good mage, so maybe she can save us, but I doubt it. And new lovers. Are you kidding me? Malarkey and the King Claw. Malarkey tried to woo the King Claw by lauding his medical skill. We need to bury all of these people. Let's make the sarcophagus somewhere. Maybe right in here. So in total, how many people died? Is this eight? Yep, nine people dead. Yeah, now we do not need all of this food, but this is horrible. Yeah, the remaining people working on the base must work hard. We need to recruit new people. That is the plan. Recruit as many new people as possible. I mean, the good thing is that we have a lot of resources, a lot of food. So all of that is good. The infrastructure structure is good. The only thing I'm worried about is defenses and the next demon attack. How in the world are we supposed to win against that? Well then sarcophaguses you need to be constructed. So Soli Light, the first one to be buried here forever. Transport crash, yeah. I mean at this point, why not? He's not too bad. Our moral guide died as well. Yeah, I think Ava has to become the new moral guide. So then, rescue burn. Oh wait, just capture him convert and all of that and recruit him. Need to install a bionic leg on Ava. It was destroyed. Yeah, I think it's all thanks to Ava that we're alive because she's a vampire and she cannot really die unless her brain is destroyed. More sarcophaguses being constructed. So we got the King Claw, Menarchy. Uh, oh no, no, no. I mean, we got Soleil Light, Raid, and Sacred in here. Anyway, Silver will be up soon, but she is blind. That is not the thing we like to see. Well then, Silver, let's see your construction skill now that you're blind. Construction success chance, uh, not too bad. Forbes Obsession Silver, yeah. We need to hold a funeral for each one of these people. I also need a nutrient place dispenser now because we don't have a cook. An infestation? Are you kidding me? No way. That is, that is horrible. I suppose they will die in the heat box though. Well then, Ava become the moral guide. A lot of these people also had lovers now. Yeah, everyone is just depressed. All the sarcophaguses have been constructed almost, so it's time to do the funerals, bury everyone, say goodbye. Malarkey has a passion in crafting, so you need to become a crafter now. Anyways, funerals, let's go. So, tragedies like these can happen in Rim World where a lot of people get wiped out, but it's not the end. You never give up. I think we're lucky that we have five or actually six people alive still in the colony. We just need to get Tell me her go juice, but yeah, grieve everyone, grieve. Yeah, we still have how many? Eight more funerals to attend, so sleep and get going, everyone. A heartwarming funeral. More like that, please. Well, halfway done with the funerals, it's taking quite some time. Anyways, the base didn't really take that much damage. Yes, the people inside the base. A home is not home without its people. Ah, forest fire, please die, insects. I might have to draw an explosion with Melar to take care of these insects. I think just to prepare, the kill box needs to be activated, or the heat box. Now then, huge explosion upon these grounds. Oh! 
<laughs> yeah, I think we don't need the heat box anymore. That was more than enough. Yeah, let's rescue Melarki. That was extremely satisfying. I mean, if we have something like that for each raid, then we should be fine. Yeah, insects are getting cooked. And yeah, they're all dead, the insects. They just got scorched. Anyways, please, we need to recover from this horrible accident the demons have caused us. So the nutrient paste dispenser need that. Yeah, silver is blind, but it doesn't actually affect too much. I thought it would be worse, but it's not horrible, I would have to say. And now the last few funerals. Ava, why are you vomiting on the circuit? Are you so... You are so disrespectful. I oh, are indeed deep trouble Ava I promise you food poisoning you hold it in you hold it in to show respect anyways the last funeral who is in here let's see your lord chimpus yeah so soul I light the marine raiden survivor sacred researcher sarlugo artist poro dude scout the green swarm assembler kagoref the grunt jade cave explorer lord chimpus the pirate now we will not forget you you will always be in our hearts there are still insects here are you kidding me wipe them out there we go dead insects and finally got go juice production so now we can get kami up Loading Kami, finally up. Yeah, and she's going straight to deep drilling. What a dedicated woman. Exotic goods trader, can you help us in this situation? Yeah, no, this is what we're trading. We might have a little bit too much food. Please do not so. Or actually just disable this growing zone. Now then, Palastial deep drilling. I'm not sure if we will need this, but oh well. Scan underground Palastial. Okay, not too far away. We also got a car combat suppliers so we're going to buy some cataphract stuff tech print cataphract armor i mean surely if we have cataphract armor we will not die to the demons rejected proposal the king clan malarkey hmm. now then i need more transport crashes anything any recruit will do oh i didn't notice but every single person alive is a mage so we actually cannot do the hero melding yeah not much happening at the colony so far though but as you can see the wealth has just dropped from like 340,000 down to 280. Most of that is in items and creatures, pawns. Yeah, Ruby is depressed because the green swarm died, her husband. And new recruit, Burn. Yeah, she will be great. Art, social, pretty damn good. Well then, Kolbaka, welcome aboard. And a mechanoid cluster. What is this? Right on top of the base. I've almost never seen that. Now, um, yeah, they just activated instantly. What in the world is this? Please kill them all. Now then, more of them coming. Need EMP grenades, so cool backup. They're getting destroyed. And there we go. Now Milarki was down due to a social fight, but as you can see, we are so powerful. And for the turrets, we need a smoke launcher. And the mech cluster has been defeated. That was quite the location for that mech cluster, wasn't it? Uh oh, Berserk Kami. Somebody please down her. There we go. Elemental Assault. Are you kidding me? Hmm, they should go right through the kill box, I assume. Looks like they will go through the kill box, so that's good. Well then, Malarkey, you can solo this, I suppose. Let's do something like this. 
Look at them all die. This is such a great weapon. And there we go. The rift has closed, so yes, a few of them. Just one more, that was good. And they're all dead. Yeah, I'm not sure what the plan really is now. I mean, do we just research? Try to go for the end game? Maybe we should get some good armor first. So go up to Cataphract Armor. Oh, what is this? 41 man hunting mega sloths for an anti grain warhead. We will take that. Oh, Cataphracts. Okay. We get a bunch of health. That is interesting, but we don't really need it. Oh, they can cook. Some of them can cook. That is wonderful. Wonderful. Well then, Mega Sloths, let's see what you have to offer. Yes, destroy all of them. Doomsday them for heaven's sake. Yup, that is nice, that is nice. Triple rocket launch them. Yeah, I mean, they're all just dead. So then some Mega Sloth meat, some free food, although we have way too much food. Might have to make another freezer if I'm honest. Anti-grain warhead, there it is. More new lovers, the King Claw and... What? So the King Claw proposed to Malarkey and Malarkey rejected it. And now he went ahead and become Ava's lover. That is just wonderful. The King Claw courted Ava by comparing her to a deep basin. Now then, I think the tomb has to become a freezer because, well, we need food storage. Transport crash. Let's see here. Melee construction intellectual depressive cannibal. She's also an impid, so they are naturally pessimistic. No. However, we do need more people, so recruit. There we go, a proper tomb freezer. Raid from the mech hive. Breachers. Let's see this. I have a plan. Just explode them. Now then, let's do this, you two. Ah, oh, we only have Melarchy as the red mage now. <laughs> no double explosions. Although we do have Firestorm with silver. That did something at least. Termite dead. Let's get behind the walls. Ah, uh, get back on oh, no, a ruby. Ah, oh, right lung destroyed on ruby. That's what we like to see. Invisibility and shred them silver. We have invisibility for how long? Yeah, I don't know, but shred them. Look at this. Oh, now we need to pop it again. No, we have no more mana. Get the hell back, silver. Destroy them, silver. Yeah, they're all dead. Yeah, it is quite tough when we don't have enough people. And recon armor go up to, what is it? Marine armor. Oh, who did we convert? We converted Konovos, so now we can reform the ideology. Yeah, no idea what to go for, actually. You know what? Go for high life. That should be good. So, this is our newly reformed ideology. Yeah, everybody just do drugs. <laughs> And a Manhunter pack. Ah, more Mega Sloths. Oh, well, yes, stay inside the compound. And a Prism Break. Ah, yes, one woman. Konova. Ah, so fast. Oh, no, Silver, stop her. Yeah, Silver, just blink. She is too fast. Ah, uh, okay. She's just dead to the Mega Sloths. That's good to see. Ah, uh, yeah, she, <laughs> she got back in. Yeah, now she realized that she didn't want to die to the Mega Sloths. And she's downed. And the plague on four people. Wandry joins dude. Dude, this is perfect. We need more pawns. So let's see here. Ooh, quick sleeper, nimble, eccentric. Could become a shooting specialist. Yeah, the new shooting specialist. We first need to convert him though. Welcome aboard, just a Yumi. Mech cluster with a smoke spewer. Yeah, Ava, somebody get out there. 1.8 days. That's not very inviting. Oh well, Ava, you have to go. 
And a raid from what is this? Neanderthals breachers. 75 of them against how many humans? 7 humans. Another explosion is required. So then huge explosion somewhere around here. I think that should be good enough. Oh, no, 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 no. Right there here we go the wiping we wiped them out now silver needs to rescue her please tell me we can teleport with midlark in our hands yeah uh, that will not work winter's fury please kill them all silver yeah, they're all fleeing. <laughs> so that's one way of dealing with them. So yeah, 7 against 77 or whatever it was. Not a problem with magic. We yeah, have saved Malarkey now. And I also started the Winter's Fury because I thought we would need it. Apparently not, but now we need to stay indoors. Oh, need more recruits. So let's see here. So we have Vela here. He is good. And Gabella here. He is also good. Mining. So people have to go out and rescue them. Gabella is about to get down. Yes, capture and Ava coagulate and capture Vela. So two more pawns to be recruited and to become mages. Oh yeah, Kombaka can become a mage. We need to do a hero melding for her. Another prism break, this time with a lot of people. And they're all downed. So then Kombaka, hero melding. Ooh, converted Jimmy, so get released and become the shooting specialist. Well, defenses are starting to look good again. And now that we've got three more pawns coming in, we should be fine. What? Berserk Konova and she instantly died. Okay, not too bad of a loss, to be honest. A siege from group of Edakin. We're actually dealing with a too deep infestation, so this is just wonderful timing. Yeah, they're all dead here, so that's good. And now for the siege. Yeah, another explosion should do it. So oh, then, Malarkey, another huge explosion. Yeah, they're all just dead. No need for an anti-grain warhead. We can do that for free. Any new recruits, perhaps? What is this? Iron Stomach, Quick Sleeper, Woodsman, Giant's Blood. Yeah, so I'm thinking of recruiting Kovark. She is quite all right. Uh, please don't tell me he's going to crawl out here. Uh, no, he got up. Well, that's rip. Yeah, look at the graveyard here. We killed off everyone. <laughs> Camp here guarded by five wasters, and we only need four soldiers. We'll take this for the small vanometric power cell. Wow, this is quite a unique base in the mountain. These charged miniguns. And they're all dead. Any good loot in here? Nope. I forgot about the smoke cloud. Yeah, we got that raid from Neanderthals. So, Ava, go out there once again. Caravan has arrived. So, let's see. Hmm, this is quite the map. Wow. Now oh, then, let's get out of here. And another mechanoid cluster. What is this? Climate adjuster on minus 10 temperature. That shouldn't be too bad, right? And marine armor. Yes, wait for the last cataphract armor tech print and then we will be decked out in that. So for now, maybe research some stuff in this tab. You know what? Maybe Malarkey should become the production specialist, the new one. She is perfect for it. <laughs> Combat supplier, let's see if this is it. Tech print healing factors, not what we want. Anyways, this is what we're trading, getting some armor. We are so rich now, wow. Our wealth is actually better than it was before, barely. We can recover from the great disaster. I mean, we are fine, everyone. Ooh, what is this? Inspiration path... Kulbaka. He wants to become a golemancer. That's good. Well then, congratulations, Kulbaka. So let's see here. Golem people. They seem pretty good. Ah, you know what would be perfect? Growth vats. I mean, get a bunch of kids and repopulate the colony that way. So yeah, I just get like three kids or something and we should be fine, right? Another transport crash. Ah, she's from the Empire, so she cannot join us, unfortunately. We will, however, rescue her for some factions 
production relation points and growth vats. We already have fertility procedures, so it's time. So extract some ovums, everyone. We have so much food and these growth vats will consume a lot, so a good way to get rid of it. Now then, all the ovums have been extracted, so the men need to fertilize them. I need all the men to come over here. Ah, oh, we only have two men in the colony, the King Claw and just a Jimmy. So then insert the embryos, so we should be good. Those three will be very close growing up. I would also like to construct a dimensional mana pocket. This thing stores a bunch of mana here, so maybe we will need the mana in the kill box. I would also like to make robes of the Archmage. Robes designed by a superior race that are meant for the highest class of magic users who are worthy of additional power and insight. These lightweight flowing robes seem to propel the wearer as if carried by a great winged beast. So silver should wear that. And we've also constructed the children's learning room. They will be born in 6.2 days. What in the... Ah, all the mechanoids woke up. That is very inviting. Well then, some human threat might take care of that in the future. So just zone ourselves out of there. Yeah, they're all dead. There was a shaman merchant, and when they left the map, they activated it. Uh-oh, they're attacking our walls. Please go back. Please go back. Yeah, I don't think they're going back, unfortunately. Well, we have to deal with this. Hold on, this will be great. They all need to die. Fireball silver. Look at those charged miniguns demolishing them. The winter's rain is carrying us. But I mean, yeah, they're all dead. Just like that. We need to replace the kill box with plasteel, or like around here. Well then, rest up everyone, and then we take care of the turrets. Uh, maybe we can leave it for human raiders, no? Yeah, let's do that. Oh no, one more centipede incoming. Die, for heaven's sake, just die. The thing cannot even do anything. Yeah, they're all just dead. There we go. Replace the kill box with plasteel and shred down all of these mechs. I oh, know there are mech assemblers here. I don't want to deal with that, please. Just take care of the mech cluster now. I love these charge miniguns. They're so satisfying. And the mech cluster has been defeated. We also need to make Silver the leader again. I forgot because she died. Also need to replace this part of the kill box with Palastil. We also have a spell here to enchant weapons. So use that on just a Jimmy. No melee weapon. Okay, only melee weapons. Here it is, the mana pocket. So 2000 mana. That's not bad. Oh, we scanned Palastil quite close to us. Very good. 3000 Palastil. Oh, inspired recruitment on the King Claw. So recruit someone here. Gabella, welcome aboard. He will be good. Welcome aboard, Zuljun. He will be doing mining and yeah, maybe something else like art and intellectual. Now we have a lot of miners, so that's good. People that can mine, but we need more craftsmen, cooks, and more constructioners. Oh well, Vela can do construct and plan, so that's good. Sadistic rage on silver. Uh oh. Yeah, Silver, you're the one getting downed. I would also like to make another golem, because Kobaka is a goldmancer. So, dormant stone golem. New recruit, Vela. Welcome aboard, Draconian. You will be doing construction, plants, and intellectual. Slowly but surely, we are recovering from this incident with the demons. Healthy vat birth. So, we got male, female. The female was first, so you are going to be the oldest sibling. Well then, female Norrecht. Well, 
not come on board. Then we have change for the mail. And let's see what the last baby is. But we need to insert these babies back until they're three years old. Let's see here. Another female. Nice. Well then, Catherine. Welcome aboard. So, that is all the kids that we should need. Hopefully, you all don't die. What is this? Birthday. And Xamu Silver got hearing loss. So, now Silver is blind and deaf. What is this? Gab crash. Thank you, Phages. Why not? Let's show them the power of the explosion. Here we go. Yeah, that was nice. The vampire survived. Right arm torn off on the Sangifage. It's death resting. Unwaveringly loyal, so cannot recruit them. We have a cook here, but again, unwaveringly loyal. Now then, just a Jimmy. Solo the rest. And they're all fleeing. And uh, no, they're not. No, they're all dead. Oh, well, Sangifage. I need some organs, actually, right? Yeah, right lung I need. I need everything. For all reinforcements in the base. What in the world? Why are they friendly? Are we friendly with this faction or something? That makes no sense. Oh well. Yeah, look at that. She's friendly now. Oh wait, can we capture some of them then? I would like to do that. I need a crafter or a cook. Let's see here. Yeah, crafting double passion lush. So what is it? He loves alcohol. I'll take you and no cooks. Yeah, everybody else is fine, I suppose. Come over here. We're resting you. Yeah, we can just arrest them and the rest of them won't be enraged. I mean, maybe I get Haruto here. We only have one medic. No, no, no. We're fine. This guy right here already has medical passion. Now then, Miss Organ Donor, we're going to harvest every single organ. Manhunter pack. 55 grizzly bears. Just stay inside the compound. Now then, robes of the arc mage. So then, silver. Wear that. Yeah, look at silver now. Take off that cloak. Yeah, she looks pretty good. Well then, all the organs out of the vampires. So, Ruby needs a new lung. We also made a paragon's helm. So, let's see this. Looks pretty cool. A war merchant. They're about to die. What in the world is that class? Did you see that? The Duskbringer. That's a cool class. And they're all dead. And now they flew on three people. New recruit, Kanzaki. So as I said, mining animals and crafting. Yes, crafting we need. Welcome aboard, Dr. Reaper. We need to execute this damn vampire. No longer have a need for her. We can also do another hero melding, so just a Jimmy. Everyone needs to become a mage. No way! Right after an inspiration arcane path. That was quick. So let's see here. What is he? He's a scholar. Wow. Wasn't sacred a scholar until she died. Masterwork charge miniguns. Yes, what we like to see. Anyways, berries are gone, so go outside. Elemental Assault. Yep, more of these things. Yes, destroy this thing. Yeah, that was quite easy. Now then, I would also like to research some instruments here. I would like to get some turret packs for combat, but then I think we should actually go into the ship here. I think we're ready. We're still waiting for cataphract armor, though. Oh, wait, we can make a mecha golem. I should make one of those. I would also like to grow some of these bushes here. Pomana cerium bush. I think they're used to make mana potions. Yeah, I need to extract cerium from that and then make mana potions. I would also like to make one of these dormant hollow golems. They seem good as well. I mean, Kolbaki is a golemancer, so it should be good. Oh, exotic goods trader. Please have cataphract armor. No cataphract armor. Anyways, this is what we're trading. We're also going to craft up some more spells here for our mages. Dormant hollow golem. Let's see this thing. It just needs to recharge, but we can implant a bunch of stuff here. Staff of blazing power we can implant. We have that. Just how powerful can we make these things? We might have just a few too many upgrades here. Need more plasteel. Ooh, change became a child. 
wild. So the rest will follow. Yup. Welcome aboard, kids. We need more bedrooms. So then, kids, equip your assault rifles and get going. I need you to haul and clean the base. Wow, we already have 14 pawns. Is that how many we had before the slaughtering? Exotic goods trader. Hello, do you have cataphract armor? No cataphract armor here either. So you're selling off a liver. So we can actually assign the goldmancer to Kolbaka. Does that do anything? I hope so. Uh-oh, just a Jimmy became useless thanks to this scholar trait. Shooting accuracy minus 30. We need another shooting specialist. He can barely even aim. Another meteorite shower of bunch of goodies. Now then, hollow golem, can you activate? There we go. What in the world is this thing? Interesting. That is quite the golem. It can also shoot with the staff here. Wow, that is actually really good. Can it destroy these alpacas? That is extremely good. Yeah, this golem. We just get 10 of these and we're OP. I need to see the mecha golem. I mean, look at that thing. This is one of the coolest golems that I've seen. Yeah, no more stone golems. Give me these hollow and mecha golems. Speaking of which, I need the mecha golem now. And this is just the golem with like half of its upgrades. Unfortunately, it doesn't move too quickly. I can upgrade its movement speed with water affinity. Need to do that. What is this? New base assault. Eight wasters. I'll take this yet again for the small venometric power cell. Yeah, they're all fleeing. Kali here, are you good? No, you're not. Let's just get out. Now then, Mecha Golem incoming. And as you can see, more bedrooms have been constructed. Now then, Mecha Golem. New lovers again, Dr. Reaper and Kulbaka. Nice. Wait a second, just a Jimmy, I can begin severing of Chosen. So this will essentially remove the mage skill from just a Jimmy, which we need to do because he can barely aim. This will be unfortunate, but it needs to be done. So yeah, there we go. And now his shooting accuracy should be good again. Minus 14 allowed sever magic. Yeah. Now then Mecha Golem activate. There it is. What in the world is this thing? Oh. Well, this thing is much faster at least. And a raid from, what is this, Irakin. They will prepare for a while, so maybe explode them. Ah, oh, no, there are two groups. All meleeists. That is interesting. Oh, well, Malarkey, explode these people. Yep, one group is fleeing. I wonder why. So yes, rescue Malarkey and the other group should also be dead. Now we could activate the heat box, but let's kill them personally. Now then, it's time. Ooh, the golem is destroying them. These hollow golems with that weapon is actually broken. The damage on that thing, I mean, look. They're insta-dying to the hollow golem. No way, I need like 10 of these and we've beaten the game. What in the world is this weapon, the hollow staff? Yeah, I need to keep on upgrading her or him or whatever this thing is and then yeah, keep on destroying the enemies. Anyways, they should all flee. Yep, they're all fleeing. Let me just upgrade these people. So then, what is it? What is this? Gatling cannon for the dormant golem. A mining laser. What is all of this good stuff? Upgrade upgrades, baby. Anyways, just make a few more dormant hollow golems. Another exotic goods trader. Still no cataphract armor. Draconian has a tantrum and is going to destroy my steel high-tech research bench. Uh, Tordoy self-tame. Well then, welcome aboard, VQ. Another hollow golem, so activate it. And a raid from the Cancer Crew. Breachers, 55 of them. We just explode them. Let's just firestorm them, how about that? That should do it, look. Wow. Oh, that's a lot of damage. Are there any cooks in here? I need a cook. Choker here. Great memory insatiable. Well, first we need to defeat the raid. How about another firestorm? 
Oh, they're all fleeing. All we did was cast a few firestorms and they fled. Anyways, needed that cook. Anyone else here who is a good cook? Yeah, not really anyone too good. So then choker, finally another cook. Now more hollow golems, so more of these staffs. They are OP. <laughs> We had a too deep infestation, but as you can see, we demolished them, especially the hollow golem. This thing is something else. It's tending to its own wounds. What? We have upgraded it quite a lot, though. Look at the hollow golem soloing a pack of muffalos. But anyways, it has been 400 days here in Rimworld. So yeah, this episode was something else. We lost a bunch of people here, but we somehow recovered. Our wealth is doing better than ever, as you can see, so it reflects upon our colony almost 400,000 wealth so i mean yeah next episode we shall research the whole ship and yeah let's try to beat the game make like five or ten of these hollow golems and destroy the end game of rim world and hopefully they can beat the demons from a rim world of magic those demons destroyed us but anyways thanks for watching and if you're bored then watch this video next